Hello everybody, I'm Chili Cookie and today I'm playing in the new Omega Minecraft server, home of Vintage Beef. And behind me you can see there's a lobby for UHC. Then you can also make your own zoo and over here is Abba Caving and that's what I'm here for today. I've not played it before so wish me luck. So if we head on over here, you'll be able to see, well, Vintage Beef dressed as a miner and also the top scorers. Now I've never come anywhere close to these scores. So well done guys, they are pretty amazing. <laughs> and we'll just give him a little click and we'll be able to start playing. So first I wanted to show you my very first time. And yeah, I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> so please bear with me but as you can see you start with everything you need you've got unlimited food supplies unlimited torches and you do get plenty of cobblestone but it's not unlimited so you do need to gather some of that occasionally especially when you're needing to tower out <laughs> of some ravines and I wasn't aware that iron and coal give you nothing so yeah don't waste your time with them and then I made the mistake of jumping down a big hole why I, I don't know so yeah redstone and lapis give you one point I believe they are looking into maybe making lapis worth two uh, gold gives you three points diamonds five emeralds I believe are seven and you also get points from items in chests like name tags enchanted apples golden apples and horse armor so always be on the lookout for them and if we skip forward to the end <laughs> you can see I didn't get the greatest score. I don't even think I got over a hundred. I just, I got myself lost and then spent far too much time doing this. Managed to find a bit of redstone at the end, but yeah, not the greatest. But it's all about having fun, so it doesn't matter. And there we go. Not the best round, but not bad for a first try. So let's head on over to our second try. Now you do need at the moment at least five people for a, a round to start. But the more people play, the easier it'll be to get a game going. And look at this, gold straight away, perfect. So even though gold is only worth three, it does tend to be the, the best thing to find really to get your score up. Obviously, because diamonds are quite rare, emeralds even rarer. So yeah, try and go for the gold. And yeah, at this point, I didn't realize how important it would be to run around. And yeah, can you see them? Diamonds. How did I not see them? <laughs> no idea. And let's head back to get the gold we saw down here and then we'll skip to the end and again I got myself stuck in a ravine what a waste of time definitely look from above down a ravine if it does look like there's anything good obviously go down and get it but don't go down for the sake of it it's a waste of time most of the time and look as always a bit of redstone at the end <laughs> so yet again not the greatest score better than last time though and then here I was waiting to do it again and look who decided to pop in Mr Vintage Beef himself so that's one good thing about the server occasionally you might get to play a round of ABBA with Vintage Beef so let's see how I got on against the master himself Okay, here we go. Okay, got some gold. Let's get that. Okay, not too bad. Don't fall in the lava though. Perfect, I'll grab some redstone. Now, some people say to just dismiss redstone, but it does all add up. So I don't get it all, but I try and get as much as I can. And unfortunately for me, um, sometimes the chests don't want to open <laughs> okay we've got a diamond and we've got a name tag perfect okay what else have we got yeah might as well grab it while I'm here 
Lots of lovely gold. Okay. Yep, so run. Run as much as you can. And I've started to place torches in the hope that mobs don't spawn. Because <laughs> I have been killed a few times by cave spiders and a witch. Avoid them at all costs. <laughs> okay, a bit of lapis. And let's skip to the end. And here I am. <laughs> Stuck in a mine shaft, absolutely lost. And is there anything? Nope. Put out the fire so I can get past. Oh, it's it still lit me on fire. <laughs> okay. Is there anything else? Because as you can see, I'm in second place. I've got no chance of catching up to beef now. But I will take second, believe me. <laughs> this is my best score. So I think beef brought me a bit of good luck. Anything down here? No. Let's get that last bit of uh, redstone. There we go. And that's it. Yep, second place. I can live with that. A new high score for me, anyway. <laughs> Perfect. And, of course... I had to drag Marrow along too. It wouldn't be the same without my partner, would it? So he hasn't played before, so obviously I don't expect him to be brilliant on his first try. But let's hope he brings me some good luck. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, we've got some gold again. I'm always happy to start with some gold. What else have we got? More gold? Yep, I'll take that, thank you. And more gold, okay. And is there anything else I can see? A little bit of redstone, why not? And let's skip to the end. So we have a bit of lapis. Um, I'm not seeing anything. It's only because I can see some redstone. That's the only reason I'm coming down here. <laughs> and obviously we're in the last seconds. So yeah, I'll take whatever I can. And it, it does seem to be that I always end on redstone. Anything else? A bit over there. I'll do some pokey holes. Anything? No. No, I don't think I'm going to get anything else now. Not the worst score though. Not the best, but not the worst. And now we move on to my best score. <laughs> now I've included all the footage for this but I've sped it up because it is sort of what eight nine minutes long. <laughs> so it just shows you anyone can get a relatively good score. I mean not to be on the leaderboard or anything but I've got to say I've really really enjoyed playing this. It's so much fun and it, it's so quick easy anyone can do it. So yeah, don't stress yourself out about getting on that leaderboard. Just have fun. Because I guarantee you will. And especially if you can get some of your friends involved as well. Oh, and mobs. Yeah. There are mobs. You saw in the last one, there can be some rounds you might not actually even come across any. You manage to keep your distance, run around them. But then other times, they just seem to be everywhere and they're in your way. <laughs> So try not to waste too much time fighting them. Obviously, if they've got you cornered, yeah, bash away and kill them. Otherwise, though, run away and you'll find, yeah, some other ores somewhere else. It's also been pointed out that the biome you start in can make a big difference onto what ores are there. I keep hearing the badlands mentioned and I have noticed when you spawn in a badlands biome, there does seem to be a lot more gold. I don't know how true it is though, 
but you know like I say it's just for fun And I want to take this opportunity to also point out that they also have a Discord to go along with this server and I highly recommend you joining that. It's quite a fun place to be but this server is only a few weeks old so occasionally there might be a little problem and the Discord channel obviously has lots of ways you can report that or see if there is a problem <laughs> because it normally will have already been reported and they'll be looking into it. So just bear with them. There can be a bit of lag every now and again, but like I say, it's a very new server. There are gonna be teething problems, like with anything when it first starts out. But in the meantime, just have fun and yeah, come and chat in Discord. And like with all games, don't be a troll. <laughs> be kind and respectful of the other players. We're all here just to have fun. And as you can see, I'm finding plenty of gold. So I must admit, I didn't check in this one which biome I was in, but I'm going to guess it's the Badlands. <laughs> and let's put out some of that lava. There's far too much lava at times. And as you can see all around me, you do spawn in these massive caves, which reminds me of the, the new update coming out, especially if you've played the snapshots. So that's quite nice to see. More diamonds. Yeah, what else can we find? We're about halfway through the round. Anything? And yet there'll be times you'll find chests and there will be nothing that you can take from it. Also, there are occasions you might find a load of items on the floor as if someone has died. Now, when someone dies, I don't think they drop their items, but what's happened basically is somewhere a chest has tried to spawn, hasn't, and all the items have ended up on the floor. If you collect them and then find a chest, you can put the items that are worth points into that chest and then take them out and get the points. Otherwise, they'll just sit in your inventory and you won't get the points for them. So it's definitely something to bear in mind. And yeah, there's a skeleton after me. So I'm doing what I said earlier and just running away. I haven't got time for him. And more gold. Lovely, lovely, lovely gold. It is. I definitely think it's gold that ends up winning it for most people. But yeah, I'm finding quite a lot of diamonds in this one too. And yeah, I'll always try and get my lapis and my redstone because it does add up. The one thing I'd personally say though as well is to stay out of the mine shafts you get lost there never seems to be much in there obviously have a little look in case any of the chests you know are visible but on the whole yeah they seem to be a waste of time i can imagine some people might say different but personally my experience has been a waste of time and i'm in lava <laughs> thank you mr creeper <laughs> But you'll also notice you have a lot of health. I think it's mostly because, yeah, we're just here to play and have fun. If we just died constantly, it would lose its appeal. So, yeah, I've fallen in lava a few times and survived. So don't worry about that. And as you can see, that's how I got my high score of 512, which I am pretty proud of. Not the best, but I'm happy with it. So why not join us? And who knows, you might even get to play with Vintage Beef himself. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please remember to like and subscribe. Until next time, bye-bye.